Cheryl was happily set up with a potential suitor over the airwaves by pal Nick Grimshaw on Thursday, weeks after she said that she would date someone out of the public eye. In a recent interview, the 35-year-old admitted she would be open to meeting someone outside of the showbiz world, using a shelf stacker from Sainsbury's as an example. And following her admission, Cheryl's pal Nick jokingly took it upon himself to see if her words stood true as he looked for a potential suitor on his BBC Radio 1 drive time show and asked his listeners to apply with a romance CV if interested. One listener named Chris jumped at the chance to possibly date Cheryl and instantly sent his credentials to Grimmy, who vowed to be his wingman throughout the process. After chatting to Chris, the broadcaster called Cheryl and went through his romance CV, which stated he had a full UK driver's license, was good at giving compliments and was trustworthy. Piquing the pop star's interest, Cheryl told pal Nick to put her through to Chris as she had a few questions to clear up, firstly what make and model his car was. Hesitant to answer, Chris finally caved and uttered, it's a Volkswagen Golf which she replied, we like that. Mediating the introduction. Nick egged the listener to give Cheryl a compliment, which he had stated was a skill of his. Chris, who described himself as six feet one, athletic with dark hair and piercing brown eyes, began, Cheryl, you're the most kind-hearted, kindest soul that is out there possible. You're not bad-looking either Cheryl. And while grateful for the compliment, the Geordie beauty really wanted to know the real Chris, asking what dish he deemed to be his specialty. And that's when the sparks truly started flying. He said, My specialty is a Sunday roast dinner. To which she replied instantly, Me too, I love a Sunday roast dinner. Chris added, To be fair, I haven't tasted roasted potatoes better than my own. The bold statement caused Cheryl to suggest, We could have a roast potato off. As roast potatoes sparked their chemistry, Chris confidently pushed for another phone call with the British star and asked if she wanted his number. And it seemed their brief chat left Cheryl wanting to know more about the mysterious listener as she surprisingly asked Grimmy to pass on his number. The radio presenter said, Cheryl do you want his number now? To which she answered, yeah, not over the air. The pop princess, who previously said she was taking a break from love after her split from Liam Payne. The father of her one-year-old son Bear, recently gave many of her 3.7 million followers hope that she might take them up on the offer of a date. The former X Factor judge admitted she would be open to meeting someone outside of the showbiz world, using a shelf stacker from Sainsbury's as an example. She said, I would 100% date a shelf stacker from Sainsbury's. What you do doesn't define you as a human being. Cheryl elaborated by saying it doesn't matter to her what her next partner does for a living, as long as he treats her right. She also revealed she would be happy to be the breadwinner if her boyfriend were to stay at home and look after Bear. Cheryl and Liam were together for two and a half years and announced their split last July. Speaking recently to Mail Online, the singer insisted she is still on good terms with her ex. She said, There's no animosity whatsoever. We are learning all the time. And it's good, it's healthy. We are just like any other couple that have gone through this, but we have a few more eyes watching us. Just a few.